In Cougar News, they announced the next <laughs> Bachelorette just announced a 38-year-old hairstylist from Sacramento. Mm. This sounds like a fun idea. Ariel, do 38-year-old women deserve love? Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Is that a... <laughs> First of all, also, I love that it took them 15 seasons to figure out that women over 30 need love, too. That's right. <laughs> Applause. Like, hello. Applause. Yeah. If you don't applaud, that means you're a bad person. We know they need love, it's just not entertaining. Oh. <laughs> no, it is. You know but what they, the stakes are higher. Yeah, they are. That's the ticket. They should have a biological clock running on the side of the... <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I get old people are gross. Just I hear it every day. Over yeah. But I think it's going to be tricky because when the guy gets out of the limo, she's like, this one. Like, well, give it, <laughs> give it a second, you know? Then she gets on her knee, and they're like, no, he's going to propose yeah, yeah, yeah. to you. She's like, we don't have all day, guys. Let's just get well, show I four. I want to be married. I want to know who they're going to get. Like, who are these guys going to be? They, can't, they better not be regular dudes, like bus driver or something like that. You know, they got to be like. Pilots. Yeah. <laughs> It can't Doctors. be somebody she could just get on her own at a bar. You know uh, what I mean? You mean he's not going to be like, here's Jim, single dad of four. You're like, oh, <laughs> my God. <laughs> oh. I would prefer if it was all 23-year-old dudes. Oh. Well, we know what you'd prefer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> two for you. No. Uh, That's two for you. Yeah, I'll take what? it out. Well, this, this woman was on the Bachelor Games. Yeah. She was on The Bachelor. She was on Bachelor in Paradise. She's like Rudy. She's like very persistent. <laughs> and she's gonna, yeah, I, yeah, let's I'm stop pulling call, for her. Yeah, let's stop calling her a hairstylist too. She's a reality star at this point. You know what I mean? No, listen, if yeah. you want to date a 38 year old hairstylist in Sacramento, just go get your hair cut in Sacramento. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you don't need to get on a TV show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't think there's a huge line outside like of Supercuts? Like, come on! Yeah, you're gonna close that yeah. sale. Chewing later. Yeah, like. <laughs> I'm getting a fake haircut just because I want yeah. <laughs> But she's beautiful, she's great. I, I think it's gonna be fine. Now, have you seen you? I don't know why everyone's panicking. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if anyone is. <laughs> <laughs> we're starting a panic, but we're gonna stop we're it. We're starting also. a panic right now, yeah. Go ahead. I, have you seen her on the, like, have you no, seen her? No, I don't her remember her from the old ones, and I've watched a couple It's of a them. train wreck. <laughs> she, well, this is the first season of The Bachelor, and I've messaged you a couple times. This is, I've never watched the show before. My wife was like, you should watch. This is the first season I've ever watched. And I, it's, I don't know why they call it The Bachelor. It just should be called Who Wants to Touch My Dick, because that is basically Whoa. who moves on to the next round. Yeah, you know what I mean? That's true. Like, if you're not willing to touch a dick, you're not going to be the winner. This woman has done seven Bachelors, and we want to thank her for her service. Okay, she's a veteran.